The animal studies show that um, the neuroprotection works probably up to 12, maybe even as much as 24 hours after injury. Um, <clears throat> however, we in, in our clinical trial, in our phase three clinical trial now, um, are required to get the drug in within four hours. Um, the reason we're doing that is, is rather complex. The animal studies, um, when, when you do an animal model, it's very homogenous. The brain injury is exactly the same. The animals are exactly the same. Everything is maintained equally. So uh, small improvements in outcome uh, can be identified in an animal model, but when you go to a human model that is very, very heterogeneous, um, that gets that improvement can get washed out in the noise. So, from the animal studies, we can show very clearly that the earlier you get it in, the better it is. So the the one hour post, the six hour post, and the twelve hour post. There's a there's a, a scale that shows the earlier the better. It makes only it's it's common sense. Um, it's a neuroprotectant, meaning it's got to protect. So if you don't get it in early, you're already behind the eight ball. Um, so that was the reason in the phase three trial, we chose a four hour window was to try to get it in as absolutely soon as possible, but yet feasible, um, and give the drug maximal chance to work. So the formulation that we use uh, in the human trials um, is natural progesterone, so that's key. Um, many of the progestins, which are artificially produced progesterones, have uh, very different um, mechanisms and very different properties. So it's natural progesterone, which by the way comes from yams, um, <clears throat> and uh, uh, we, we buy it as a powder from, from a company and dissolve it in a small amount of ethanol and then it gets mixed into an intralipid formulation uh, just before it's delivered. Uh, we give it as an IV infusion uh, over four days uh, with a taper towards the end. Um, and it's the, the goal is to reach a steady state to sort of coat the brain during that critical time period immediately after the injury.